Hello guys, my name is Brad, and this is a Modern Warfare 3 gameplay. Uh, I go 53 and 5 on kill confirmed using the AK-47. I'm not sure if I pick up any other guns. It's been a while since I watched this, and I haven't felt I didn't I didn't, I didn't feel like I didn't I didn't watch through it before making this video beforehand like I normally do. But uh, I do remember, however, though I was playing with WV40 and I was using the skill in the box. And that ga that gave me uh, some reapers and stuff. So I'm not actually sure how many gun kills I got. You can count if you'd like. I'm not going to count it, but you know, it's been a while since I made a commentary. And there's some reasons for that. I'll tell you one. Um, well, rather than going and on for like a 10 minute story of why I'm unhappy, I'm just generally unhappy. Uh, a lot of things going have a lot of things in high school. Uh, you know, I was I I grew up basically. I'm just lonely, and uh, I hate my life, essentially. But uh, there were some things that I should have done differently. I could have done differently, but uh, I didn't. And now I just have to live with those regrets, um, unfortunately. But uh, that is not what I want to talk about. I actually want to talk about a little bit about Black Ops 2, that uh, trailer. I don't remember when it came out. It came out a... Uh, <clears throat> oh, well, that guy just got owned by my care package. I have no idea if he wanted to... If he did that intentionally or not, because it, it's... it's I, I remember rewatching that several times, and I was like, why the fuck would he do that? He, and he just stands there. Like, so, I, I don't know. But, um, you know, a lot of people are hating on the Black Ops trailer, saying it's too futuristic. But let me just, uh, let me just stop you right there. Um, COD 4 was based nine years ahead of its, uh, ahead of its release date, 2016. At least some part of it. I'm not sure how many how much time passed from Modern Warfare 1 to 2. I know Modern Warfare 3 took immediately after the second game, but COD 4 came out in 2007. It was based in 2016. At least I believe it was. I think the nuke part was in 2016, at least. Uh, that's future, man. Just because Black Ops 2 has some advanced technology that is realistic for its time, because they, they, they've, even, they've even done the shit out. Uh, they're, they're going for a... Uh, fuck, what was the word? Uh, a, t a, a realistic setting based on probability. The technology, I mean, a lot of it is around now, just in prototype fa fashion. But just because there are a couple of robots... I mean, we have robots nowadays that do a lot of shit, okay? You, d you don't think in 13 years that shit's gonna be a lot better? Like, just because there's some robots doesn't make it, make it too futuristic. It makes it... make sense, okay? You, what, you want cavemen or something? <clears throat> Now, I know people don't want cavemen, obviously, but that's not the point at all. A lot of stuff, uh, some stuff, anyways, in Modern Warfare 2, Modern Warfare 3, not all that shit's real or out right now, either. So, um, you can think about that if you want. And I just noticed that, um, for some reason my PVR, like, when it records gameplay, the actual game sound is not as loud as it used to. I remember I used to have to turn that shit down. Now it's just like super low. I don't I don't remember if I changed down the volume settings in actual game, but I just don't know. It's kind of low. But anyhow, well, um, today is May 11th. Uh, May 10th was my uh, you know just yesterday was my last day of my first year of college, community college. I don't I don't plan on going back. A lot of anxiety issues and shit like that. But at the same time. I feel like it is, it's, it's kind of necessary oh, like to be in a social jacked. setting because how am I going to meet people and stuff like that, but yeah, when I was at school the other day though, I, uh, you know, I, I, like to, I like to go to Yahoo and read the stupid news, oh, Kim Kardashian got a haircut and, and whatever the fuck's going on with celebrities that no one really gives a shit about, but we click on just to read the comments. Ugh, sometimes there's interesting stuff like, uh, space exploration, like maybe they discovered a planet or something. Uh, black hole stuff. <clears throat> I read something interesting about that. It wasn't on Yahoo, but whatever. Um, so I saw something in there. One was about child pornography in New York State. And the other one was about the Canadian $20 bill. Now, normally I wouldn't talk about these because I just think it's stupid, but it just it's just so fucking stupid that I want to talk about it. Um, so in New York State, it's, it's, it <clears throat> it's not illegal to actually view po child pornography. You just cannot store it or keep it, which I think, I think, personally, I think the child pornography law is kind of retarded, but 
I mean, just like with gay people, I think being gay is pretty fucking weird. It's not natural. And if you were to say, well, how is it not natural, Brad? Well, penis is, 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 is let's be honest, penis is for vagina, okay? Penises were not made for other penises. But, um, that doesn't matter, though, because, I mean, they're, you know, not everyone has children anyways. But I'm not saying the natural thing makes it important or not, but I'm just saying, um, you know, just like people are gay, you know, it's the way they are. If, if some dude gets off by looking at kids, who the hell are we to judge him for? Well, we can judge. Who are we to stop him, right? I mean, it's not hurting when you, it's a picture. Pictures. Uh, this old lady got arrested because, you know, not a lot of people know what film is in a camera, but you had to develop that shit, and she went to develop it, and she had a picture with her grandchildren in it, taking a bath in, like, a tub or something, and she got arrested. Why? Okay, it's, it's it's almost, like, no different than, well, it's a little different, but viewing, like, anime porn or whatever, you know, who gives a shit? It's just, uh, it's just an image, whether it's a moving image, uh, like, like a movie, or whether it's a still image, a fucking picture. You know, why, why the fuck does it matter? It doesn't matter. Fuck you! And a $20 bill, uh, for Canada, apparently, it reminds people of the World Trade Center, and, you know, fuck them. Fuck them in their asses. They're oversensitive dumbasses, because there's a monument, a World War One monument, and it, it reminds people of the World Trade Center, because it looks like an 11, okay? Anything that looks like an 11, apparently, you can't use, because it reminds people of, of that shit. Well, fuck them. Fuck them right in the ass. But, um... And there was also... Uh, naked in quotation marks a naked woman on it, which I say well, that's kind of bullshit first of all It's really small. You need like supersonic eyes to look at it and who who are in I mean here's something I never got either You know a guy can take off a shirt a woman can't now. I understand nowadays It's kind of a taboo thing because women have been viewed as a sexualized object but breasts are not a sexual uh, part of the body I mean, men have them too. They're just not fucking. What's the? I don't, they're just not out as much. Uh, I don't really have the word to explain that, but big fucking deal, okay? Big fucking deal. But um, anyway, I'll see you guys later.